Geek Don't This Is Chipmunk. I am doing a reaction to um, the Conjuring 3's uh, first look uh, video. Um, I'm big horror fan. Y'all know horror movie fan. Uh, love horror movies. Love scary movies. They are the best um, genre of movies to me. Um, the Conjuring 3 is something I've been looking forward to for a long time now. I've been waiting on this for a minute. Um, I've uh, I hate that uh, James Wan isn't uh, directing because usually when he directs these movies, they blow up. They're really really good. He when he writes and directs, he does a great great job. I'm not saying that his predecessors uh, after his his films don't do as well. They really don't, but they do do a great job. Uh, <laughs> they do do a great job for uh, his material and stuff that he had came with, up with. Um, but I was really looking forward to this because I love the Conjuring uh, universe. Um, I love uh, most of the movie universes that usually brings out. But uh, the Conjuring 1 and 2 were pretty good. The, one, uh, the first one was one of the best in my top top 10 horror movies uh the first conjuring um so i'm looking forward to to this next installment to the conjuring universe um but yeah this is just the first look um i'm surprised that nothing had came out back when it was announced it was being it was going to show in 2020 but then i'm i'm glad that they gave it some more time hopefully they worked on some stuff if there's needed work on anything Hopefully they worked on a few things and stuff and got it uh, looking better, you know, since they had a little bit more time, hopefully. Um, you know, the pandemic happened, they had to push back their uh, date, but hopefully that helped with any touch-ups, if they needed to touch up anything as far with the movie. But, um, yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at it and see how it does. We'll have the, the first look goes. We know there are other stories to tell, but we've never felt the pressure to push them out there until we feel like there is a great story to tell and that we have something that, again, will be a worthy entrance to the Conjure universe. I'd like you all to sit quietly and close your eyes. I really went to Conjuring 3 to get away from the haunted house setup of the first two Conjuring films. It should be more yes, on a whole different level, something that we've never explored before in the Conjuring world. We wanted to keep our new story grounded in the feel of Conjuring movies, but we wanted to make sure we were telling a brand new story. And we think the Arnie Johnson story was something that really deserved a much closer look. As I got to the bottom of the stairs and I went to open the door, I don't remember anything from that point. The next thing I know, I was in a jail cell. And I said, what's going on here? And they say, well, you're being charged for murder. I said, well, what are you talking about? The trial of Arnie Cheyenne Johnson. This was an internationally renowned case, which was the first time in the history of law in the United States that... Yeah. That demonic possession was used as a reason for committing manslaughter. Do you think you'll be able to prove the existence of the devil in court? Truth doesn't mm. require anyone to believe in it. You're in for a much Take different ride than you've been out in other <laughs> countries. Films. Of course, yes. What's the point of a sequel if you can't outshine and outstory <laughs> and outheart the previous films? It just requires you to bring your A plus game. When I was working with Michael Shavs on La Llorona, I saw a filmmaker that really gets these kind of films. It's bittersweet for me to pass the baton on. And action! But it's good to get a fresh take on where we can take the Conjuring universe. We're offering something very special with these films, and I think that's one of the reasons people keep coming back. The final reason, of course, is that people love to be scared. I don't know that anybody has crafted or created better scare sequences than James Wan, David Sandberg, Gary Doberman, Corn Hardy, John Leonetti, Michael Shavs. Guys, we're making Conjuring 3. It's gonna be awesome. These are all people that really know what they're doing and they do an incredible job 
crafting new and original scare sequences. That's really what people come back to see. Alright, so that's the first look uh, for Conjuring 3. Um, it wasn't much to look at, but at least we get a better idea of what is happening uh, as far as where they're going with the third um, the third movie. So I'm glad to get some type of knowledge and stuff on what is actually going on uh, this go around. Um, hopefully they do a good job. Uh, I know... Uh, James Wan doesn't want to well I know he has to like use other people and get their perspective on the stuff that he had came up with but I, I say it's no one does his scares the way he does like look at Dead Silence that is a horrifying movie to me it wasn't the best as far as like um, the best in the story but it was one of the most scariest stories in scariest sequences of uh shots and stuff that i have seen in uh in a movie um yeah they he did a, he does a great job in all his films look at the first saw he did a good good job in everything that he had touched to me um but let me know what y'all think about the video and if y'all are looking forward to saw uh conjuring three apologize if y'all looking for <laughs> looking forward to conjuring three uh let me know in the comments below but um, thank you all for jumping on. If you like the video, please put a like on the video. If you like, subscribe. Please subscribe. Have a lot of content and stuff that I try to go through and uh, go on. So thank you all for just hopping on and giving me a try. Please do take care of yourselves and each other. Peace.